Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jessica. Thank you for watching. Today's video is going to be a huge fashion haul. These are items I've collected over the past few months and I just realized that I hadn't filmed any haul videos for you guys and I was kind of surprised because obviously I love to shop and whenever I'm online shopping, I love to look at other people's haul videos to see if there's anything I missed or it also helps to get a better idea of the quality of products and just to kind of see them in a different light. So I hope this helps you guys or gives you some style inspiration in case you are looking to do some shopping. We have quite a few items here. Definitely this has been over the course of a few months so it's not like I went and purchased all of these recently but I don't want this video to be too long so let's just jump right into it. The first store I'm going to start off with is Forever 21 and the first item is just this three-quarter length sleeve dress it is it does have horizontal lines and it's about mid thigh high it is bodycon dress and this was super inexpensive it was thirteen dollars and eighty cents i just thought it would be really cute to put on some ankle booties and really you could dress this up dress this down with a pair of flat sneakers and it's kind of just a good all-around dress scoop back as well and it's a really soft finish the next item is this white high collar long top and i thought this was really fun because it does have the open side so you can wear a cute lace bralette and it is fairly long as you can see so you can wear it with a pair of leggings or jeans uh throw a sweater over add a hat a long necklace and i thought it was just really cute for fall it is semi sheer though, so keep that in mind, but it is kind of that crepey material. So uh, it's definitely, I see myself wearing this a lot. Next item is just a basic. This is an open side, kind of low scoop side, just black top from Forever 21. If you're wondering, I get pretty much all my clothes in the size medium. So this was nice. It's a really nice material. It hangs well and it's not see-through. Next is this mustardy color crop top now this isn't too too short and it's not too long so i really like this because i can get away wearing it with both high-waisted skirts high-waisted shorts jeans or kind of regular waisted stuff because it's like that middle length so when you see it on me it does kind of go right in that area where it could go either way but i love this because it's like that knit material and i love this color for fall next item is a long simple black dress basically it does go all the way to the floor and what I loved about it is the front's just really simple but the back is completely open and it just has this string across the top so this is all open right here and it comes to a V so you can either wear no bra or just one of those ones that kind of cover the front and they have like sticky sides or I like to wear a really fun kind of crisscrossy bra if you want to show something cool in the back but I love this it's so easy to throw on again this could be fall appropriate throw a sweater on over it with some booties or through the summer with just some flip flops and sandals it's an awesome basic I love it speaking on throwing over a sweater this is just a kind of gray knit material sleeveless sweater vest and I like this because I live in Arizona so you don't always want to be throwing on long sleeve sweaters because you can be hot but you want to add a little something extra to your outfit it's nice to have these sleeveless ones and I like how it's kind of a lower scoop armhole and it is very very long the bottom has slits too so that's fun just adds a little bit more interest to the outfit the next store I'm going to go to is Urban Outfitters. Basically, I was in search of just some basic tees. And I like, for my body type, I'm a, more of a muscular shape with curves. So I noticed that V-necks look best on me. It kind of elongates my body a little bit. So I found this V-neck gray shirt. It's like knitted material, but very light and airy. And I got this in a medium, it's Project Social Tee from Urban Outfitters, but I noticed that when I wore it, I was either having to tie it because it was a pretty oversized medium, or kind of do that like half tuck in your pants or shorts. So, but I love the material, it just hangs well, you know, it doesn't cling on to anything, and it lays very nicely. So I went back and found it in white and black, 
but I got these in a size small. So if you're kind of similar in size to me, I would recommend the small if you wanted to be like a standard t-shirt fit. If you want to be more of that loose t-shirt fit, then go with the medium. Then you probably saw these if you watched any of my Bali vlogs, but I wanted a super comfy pair of pants that were kind of so cute to wear on our 30 plus hours of travel, three flights, and our super long trip to Bali. So I actually was in Urban and I found these. They're this really cool green, kind of army green color. They're this really comfy knit material with some drawstrings and they taper in at the bottom of the ankle. I just think these are super cute to either lounge around or wear with one of these v-neck tees, throw in some sneakers, baseball cap, or you can even kind of dress it up with some heels if you want. Next is just a comfortable bra. I, want, I didn't want to wear a regular bra f for 30 plus hours when I was traveling, so I found this at Urban and it's basically just like a seamless really comfortable maroon bra gold detailing and it does the job super comfortable I love this and now we're gonna move on to ASOS. I love ASOS. I literally buy from them all the time I got this shorts romper from ASOS everything here if I can find it I will link it below if I can't find it I'll try and find something similar for you guys so you can have some alternatives but now from ASOS the next item is a pair of leggings the top is like that stretch band material it's this wide and then the bottom has these really cute zippers along the sides so it just adds a little bit of interest to just standard black leggings and they're a really nice stretch material and I noticed a lot of leggings can be see-through but I did not notice that these were see-through they are definitely a nice feel or a good quality so loving these and then to go with those, I got this green long sleeveless top. It's a blouse material, but I like how the color adds just a little bit of interest or something different because it's more of the cotton material where this is the slinky material. It is long to go with leggings and has kind of like side slits. So I'm really loving this color for fall. I feel like I'm into that khaki army camo color if you can't tell already. The next item is this really long white button up. It's a super comfortable material. It's definitely a blouse material. You can wear it buttoned up, but what I love about it is the back is open. So if you don't want to wear it buttoned up, I love how you can throw this over an outfit and it's almost like a cardigan but adds a little bit more interest and a little bit more refinement to your outfit than a standard sweater and it's just so cute there's silver button details on the sleeves you can roll the sleeves up it's just super super long so this is awesome i'll definitely be throwing this over some knee-high boots and jeans and oh, a lot of things next are two crop tops these are basics but i have a hard time finding crop tops that are very nice quality material that aren't see-through and look nice you could dress up or down i've actually worn these to work and I love them so much. I got them in white and black. So those are great. A pair of shorts, just black and white shorts. I got these on sale, but they have pockets. They're high-waisted. And I just really like that black and white material. I think it goes with anything. I found a, just a basic black v-neck cami top. I like how it's v-neck in the front. And then the back adds a little bit of interest with this strap across and then it's kind of more of a square shape in the back. Super great staple to wear with jeans, shorts, I mean you can wear this with anything, a high waisted skirt, it's a really good staple to have. I got this black crop top, it is definitely see through so I thought it'd be fun to wear a cute bralette underneath and be fun to wear with like a colored high-waisted skirt. I just thought this could easily dress up an outfit throwing it on over something because it's almost that boxy shape so if you have something very fitted on the bottom and then something more loose or a little bit more volume on the top it kind of evens it out. And just found this, this was on super sales, a neon yellow green crop top but again it's the longer crop top so you could wear it with standard jeans or high-waisted stuff and it's a really nice material it has texture to the fabric so I like that the next is this strapless black sweetheart neck romper and I like it because it has this cutout in the middle and it's shorts so it's really fun I'm kind of waiting for the right event to wear this to but it is shorts on the bottom, even though it looks like a skirt. 
and the back is just straight across so this is so fun it's that scuba material so it's heavier you could wear it with boots and maybe a jacket in the fall or keep it just for summertime as well the next store I'm gonna talk about is called angle this first item is so much fun I wore this in Bali it is a black body suit and I like how it kind of cuts in so you don't see your panty lines in the back and it snaps on the bottom so you can still go to the bathroom but it is super low cut in the front and it has these really fun fringe details all across this so you could wear this with a ton of different things but it's definitely more of an edgy piece to add to your outfit the next two are basics I love the black one so much I went and got the white one standard crop tops can't go wrong I like to throw these on with basically anything these are kind of like my go-to crop tops when I want to wear something but it's that nice cotton like softer cotton material so I love them this is the same material but it's just high neck and racer back and it's this nice magenta color then I got this v-neck kind of bright red dress and I thought this was fun because the back is completely open so you could wear it with some strappy bras above the knee so it's a nice flowy material you throw it with some black high-waisted boots for the fall and a sweater and you'll be good to go another basic the last item from angle just a v-neck really soft cottony t-shirt my other ones are more fitted crop tops and this one's kind of more relaxed so I like this because obviously I wear a lot of black if you can't already tell the next store I made a online purchase for the first time from boohoo I was pleasantly surprised the fabrics and the quality of the clothes really impressed me so I'll definitely be ordering from the from them again but I got some cute dresses for our honeymoon trip and I wore some of them in my vlog so if you want to see some of them on check those out first one is just an awesome basic it's just a black cami dress but it does go below the knee so I feel like even though it's fitted and bodycon since it's the longer length it looks amazing you can dress it up with ankle booties or heels or dress it down with sandals and it's just like I've already worn this a few times it's so comfortable and very flattering one I bought with the intention of being a dress but it's definitely too scandalous to be a dress on the model uh, it looked amazing and she could pull it off but this was just too scandalous for me um, I think it is a little bit big it's a six US six so you might want to size down if you get this but super v-neck open in the front uh, with these straps straight across in the back but what makes it so cool is the front paneling is like open right here so definitely I and it's long it goes to the ground so I was only able to wear this as a bathing suit cover-up because when I walked you could kind of see your hoo-hoo in the front so yeah that was pretty much the only way I'd be able to wear it unless you had some type of like lace bodysuit or something to help cover you but this was really fun next dress I did wear this in I think the first honeymoon vlog it's an awesome black basic v-neck and it's open in the back along the sides cinches in at the waist and it's super long goes to the ground so I literally I think I wore this three times when I was in Bali it's just so easy to throw on wear sandals with it add some lipstick a, like bright pink lipstick or earrings and it's such an easy outfit and you're out the door so quickly I love this dress this is like one of my favorite things the last item from boohoo is just this strapless black dress love this as well um, this is like that cinched in material so I don't have to wear a bra with it which I love any dress or anything I don't have to wear a bra with just for comfort reasons but it is black and the only complaint I have is it's really really long like I had to tie it in a knot at the bottom because it's too long uh, so to give you a reference I'm 5'6 so unless you want to wear this with heels but for me this is more of a casual dress that I would wear with sandals so I'm gonna have to probably get it altered which that's fine because it's a nice quality material I've already washed this a few times and it's completely still looks brand new so yeah keep that in mind if you're looking at that purchase one item from misguided or at least just one that I wanted to show you from there it is this camel colored bodycon skirt it is a little bit longer it goes below your knees so I wanted to mention this because if you're looking for a good bodycon skirt this is amazing it's definitely lined all the way through it's not see-through it's a nice material where it's thick enough that you don't feel like 
you're gonna have anything showing too much but side note it is kind of hard to walk you kind of walk like a duck because it's so fitted and it goes a little below your knees so that's I probably wouldn't recommend wearing it if you're gonna be walking long distances but I love this it is such an awesome basic the next two items are kind of more springy summery but I live in Arizona it's still hot here I'm gonna be wearing shorts with sweaters and boots like all year round so for any of my other girls who are going into warm weather right now if you're in a different hemisphere or if you live in a warm state like me then I wanted to show you guys these I finally uh, caved in and I got myself some one teaspoon shorts these are the bandits and I love these they are so comfortable I wore these in an Instagram post so if you want to see them on you can go check that out but these are just so comfortable like I'm living in them they're just ripped up you wear them lower on your waist so to give you guys reference these ones are a size 27 and I've worn them more so they look a little bit more lived in these are a size 28 and I just got two different sizes I like both of them honestly they kind of feel like they fit similar to me but um, yeah just loved them so much that I wanted to get them in black as well and recently I got one item from H&M I've been looking for a good pair of high-waisted pants to wear with all my crop tops so I found these they're a really cool textured black material they have a drawstring and they taper in at the bottom so I thought these were fun and added a little bit of interest besides just wearing high-waisted jeans just something different plus they're super comfy because they're that stretchy material and I found I wanted to show you guys this because this is super basic but I found these from The Gap these are their 1969 true skinny I got these in a 27 regular and online they were originally $69.95 I have to show this to you guys I went into the store to try them on and they were on sale I think they just changed the name of them but I got them for $5 $5 five five like that's it one two three four five I was so excited. These are my new go-to skinny jeans. Super dark, great material. Has stretched to them, but not too much to where they're gonna stretch out. They held my shape and form. Love these. So if you guys have a chance, go into the Gap, check these out. They're amazing. Last two items are swimsuits. I obviously had to buy a new, or a few suits for our trip to Bali. So this first one is Acacia. Actually, they're both by Acacia Swimwear. I'm obsessed with Acacia Swimwear. So if you guys want me to do a swimsuit collection or more on that, just let me know, comment below. But I've been looking for a really good strapless top, and this is awesome. Super comfortable, kind of has these see-through holes in the back, and then this cute U-shape. There is a wire. So this, this has been the only strapless top I've found actually holds the ladies up and stays and is comfortable so I love that and then I got these bottoms to go with them they're black and then they have that kind of like rose gold underlay so you see that a little bit the other suit I got is this kind of color blocked one these are the bottoms and they are more of a Brazilian cut so if you don't like that then these will not be for you but I love these because I love that blue color and the tan that goes with it. Tie side so you can adjust your fit, which is nice. And then the top is really fun because you can have the front cut across like this. Or you can pull this up and have both pieces go over your neck. So, loving Acacia Swimwear, but um, definitely I think I have a swimsuit problem. So, if you guys want to see more on that, let me know. I'll do that for you. Then the last two items I have are shoes. The first pair I got from Nine West. They were having a sale, so hopefully these are still online. But look how amazing these are. Ah, bright red pumps, closed toe, but almost like a cuff at the top. Zips up the back. And Nine West shoes are like my go-to. They're super comfortable, great quality, and I just love the strappy detail here. I've tried them on, they are comfortable, so I cannot wait to style these shoes. They're so amazing. And the other pair I actually got for a Bali trip and then didn't end up wearing them because it just didn't turn out to be a place where you're wearing clubbing outfits and heels that much. I wore a lot of sandals with dresses. But I got these, and these are the Windsor Smith kind of like strap-up heels. 
The leather, the quality of these is amazing. All these laser cutouts are so beautiful and I feel like these will go with everything. So I cannot wait to wear these, but definitely these straps you can twist around your ankle and then tie up. They're super cute. That is everything. I hope this video isn't too long. If you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments below. I will try to link everything. If you guys like hauls or you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Until my next video, peace.